Hello and welcome to Joypads for Goalposts. Uh, this is a little impromptu episode, something a little different. At Saintly Stew on Twitter, sent us a little message, he's a friend of mine. I uh, appear on the Laps Game podcast from time to time with him. Um, and he said, at Joypads for Goalposts, a little something for next season. Also considering the character models that will probably interest at Codec Moments, at Clinical Andy and at Laps Gamer. Um, so basically, you play a very hitman looking character, sat on a swivel chair with a shotgun. Ready to just go at it, at each other. There's also a ball though. A soccer ball. And there's two goals. The objective of the game isn't to kill each other outright. It helps you win the game. Because you've got to get a ball in the back of the net. Pretty cool. The reason it may interest Codec Moments and Clinical Andy and Laps Gamer is a while ago we did a podcast special on uh, Hitman 2016. And what a brilliant game it is. Easily the best game of 2016. And could even be one of the best games of this year because there's more content coming. Um, so I'm really excited to be trying this game out. We are just going to jump straight in and play some. It looks fantastic. It looks so much fun. It's made in Unity. It's called Last Man Kicking. It's made by someone called Dick Kevin. It's available on PC and Mac. It's available to buy on HIO. It's only $1.99. The outright says on the page, it's kind of like a paid demo. They're trying to see what will or won't work. And I think, but his description for it is absolutely perfect. So before I start, we're just going to read that. Bunch of dudes sit in an office, all of them wearing black suits and white collared shirts. Everyone sits in the same swivel chairs. For a video game, Last Man Kicking sounds really boring. Add shotguns, ragdoll physics and a ball though. You have the recipe for the only soccer game left to make. I've got to say, to Kevin, you ain't wrong. Let's go, let's see what this game's like. We'll just take a quick look at the controls. There's nothing too complicated. Uh, so there's all the keyboard layouts, like I said. Um, you can play with up to four players on a keyboard, it's be a bit cramped, but would be pretty fun. I'm using a controller, I've got my uh, Xbox 360 controller plugged in here because it's just what I had to hand. So you can aim with the left stick, you spin to the right and the left with the bumpers and you shoot with A and B. Uh, that's shooting a shotgun though, not a ball. Um, so we're just going to jump in. From what I understand, it has a pretty good... Uh, what I understand is pretty good um, dropping options like you can play four all on the same, two on the same side against the eye, you can play a 2v1 and stuff. So we're just going to go um, just me versus me with the AI, I guess. And let's go. Kind of got to use the shotgun as a cluster almost. Oh, I fell off my chair. And this guy at the bottom. Oh, get up. Oh, across the face of the goal. I feel like Rocket League character, just zoom across the face of the goal. Would, oh, no, no. It would be better with your, I guess, with an actual teammate who's trying to get in. Mine's just shooting me at the moment. So perhaps the AI is not the cleverest. Oh wait, there's a. Oh shit. Oh. Oh come on, dude. You were. I set you up there. And you were too busy messing about with those guys. Ugh. No, 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 Oh, it's in. 1 0 to Team Ducker. Uh, I'm not sure if this is like first of three or something, so we'll see. Oh my god, I just went round it. Oh! He inevitably shot it in himself, unlucky. 2-0, uh, brilliant. Oh, come on dude, don't let him in, don't let him in.
Oh. Oh, wrong. I got my angles completely wrong there. Oh. I'm done, Team Rad. 2 1. Oh, 3 0. 3 1. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it is uh, first two, three, I guess. Okay, dear, and then play the results of this work-based performance is here. Score, three, one. Kills, five to four. I want to thank every one of you for making this possible. Uh, per se, I wanted to restart. I really like this. Uh, this fake, like, email interface. Um, you can also notice some pretty funny jokes in the background. Uh, we're going to have another go at that. That's really cool. So you can get points for killing. Boom. Oh, oh. Oh, come on, dude, get. Oh, the two of us were here. That's one one. Oh, come on. In. Boom. Get up here, plonker. Oh. Is another win for Team Ducker. Three one winners again. We did lose on kills there though. Um, so that's a little bit disappointing to say the least. But yeah, what a game. Brilliant game. A lot of fun. Uh, simple controls that really were the fact that there's like two scores for killing and the goals, like the it's the goals that on the end, it's the goals that matter, isn't it? You don't win a football match by getting more red cards. Um, I really enjoyed that game. Um, I'm interested to see where it goes. They've come out right and said, yeah, it's basically a paid demo. I'd love to think of the idea they're going to have leagues, online multiplayer. The physics work really nicely. The chair spinning's not too loose or anything, not too slow. Uh, the shotguns give good range. Like You can hit people from pretty far. You've got good control over the balls. And I feel like I managed to score some pretty decent goals in there. Saint Stu did ask if we were going to rank this at one point. Um, I was trying to consider how we would uh, rank these more off-the-cuff games, whether they should be in their own um, tiered, like their own list, um, and then we'll kind of decide the ones that are definitely soccer go in the list, and ones that perhaps aren't kind of in like a purgatory kind of list. Um, so let us know what you think about that idea, um, and then we may just be randomly play these football games from time to time. There's a whole bunch of them. There's Rocket League, there's Video Ball... And there's all sorts that are kind of inspired. There's a uh, Super Sex Soccer, which is kind of, I think, maybe closer to a proper soccer game. Uh, there's a lot of VR ones, lots of keepy uppy games, uh, those header ones. There's all sorts. Um, there's a couple of um, similar games to Rocket League. There's one called like Robot Soccer on Steam or something. So let us know what you think about this video, and let us know what you think about the possibility of ranking some more games. I'd love to do it. I think uh, it's entertaining. It's more fun. Um, so yeah, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Um, I'm going to go away and play some more Last Man Kicking. Hopefully I can convince my uh, partner in crime to play it and you'll be back and you'll see us rank Last Man Kicking. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.